Epic Games Fortnite on mobile is getting stronger by the day while Fortnite on mobile continues to bring in the big bucks for Epic Games, there are a lot of fans waiting to get in on the new portable action. Having already seen the game perform well on iOS in many countries, full release on the platform still seems pretty far away. The game is already topping the free App Store charts for iOS, but is still only available to players who have signed up via email and then been invited by Epic Games. It already has over 50,000 ratings on the App Store, with more likely to arrive very soon. The next wave of invites for iOS users should arrive soon, but it's not quite the same for other mobile uses. Fortnite Mobile for Android won't be arriving this month, with Epic Games confirming that it will be supported on the Google Play Store in the next few months. That could mean quite a wait for fans, but what exactly is the reason behind the delay? Well according to the development team, it's down to the sheer variety of Android devices. Epic Games Fortnite Mobile for Android will arrive in 2018 while the iOS platform has a much narrower range of phones. Android includes a massive range of different devices. Here's more from Epic Games' Nick Chester, who told Forbes, There's a very wide range of Android devices that we want to support, we want to make sure Android players have a great experience, so we're Taking more time to get it right, it makes a lot of sense that Fortnite Mobile would need more fine-tuning for Android devices due to the wider range of hardware on the market. And the announcement should help put any fears to rest that Epic Games were set to favor one mobile platform over another. As you might expect, the official list of what compatible devices will be included for Fortnite Mobile on Android has not been confirmed but fans can probably expect a wide range of devices being catered for, meaning a lot more players joining the Battle Royale very soon. This is great news for fans who might have thought that Epic Games were planning only a small release for Android devices. It also rules out any kind of exclusive deal to have the game on iOS first, over Android. This will of course include phones and tablets, with more top features set to be released to make the game more enjoyable on mobile. This will include Bluetooth controller support, which should be arriving before the end of the year. While reviews of the touchscreen controls have been favorable, a controller input will almost certainly make the game much easier to play. For those on iOS interested in joining the Fortnite mobile beta, you'll need an internet connection and iOS 11 on at least an iPhone 6s, Shea, iPad mini 4, iPad Pro, iPad Air 2, iPad 2017 devices or later. This means that the game is available to play on iPhone Shea, iPhone 7 7 Plus, iPhone 8 8 Plus, iPhone 10, iPad Mini 4, iPad Air 2, iPad 2017 and iPad Pro.